religion is always in the control business. Uh, and that's something people don't really understand. It's, it's in the guilt-producing control business. And if you have heaven as a place where you're rewarded for your goodness and hell as a place where you're punished for your evil, then you sort of have control of the population. And so they create this fiery place, which has quite literally scared the hell out of a lot of people throughout Christian history. Mm -hmm. And it's part of a control tactic. The former U.S. congresswoman who was critically injured in a mass shooting two years ago has told Congress to be bold and courageous in tackling gun violence. Gabby Gifford's speech comes six weeks after the Sandy Hook massacre. Speaking is difficult, but I need to say something important. Violence is a big problem. Too many children are dying. Too many children. We must do something. It will be hard, but the time is now. You must act. I realize now it's not a chance things are going to unravel and collapse, so it's okay morally that I promote survivalism because my audience are survivalists who are smart people, so it's okay that we fund getting the message of liberty out by selling people high-quality preparedness goods. But now I've gone from 20 30% chance that'll ever be needed to like 95%. I don't see any way out down the road. It may be a month, it may be five years, but now I realize... This country is in a train wreck, and it's only going to get worse. It may get better after the wreck, but we're going through this. That's the point I'm making. And it's not some good feeling being right. It's not some good feeling knowing that my worst projections are accurate. It's horrible. It's like when you learn your grandpa's got bone cancer. You know, It's exactly what this feels like, but beyond it. Our country is dying right now.